Hello, Gamer Nob is back. And in this video, I'm going to show you 5 ways to get free fruits and block fruits. But before we start, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Nob when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to this channel, and this will really help us make better videos. Where the echo slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dump. Okay, so in this video, you will learn of my 5 ways to get free fruits. So guys, are you ready? Let's start. First off, the easiest way is to beg. <laughs> I know most of the noobs do this technique. And guys, don't worry. Some of the players, especially the pros, will eventually give you. But not everyone will be happy. For example, look at this dude. This uh, crazy guy, bro, you is max level begging. <laughs> he even accused me of being a script user. <laughs> guys, you know gamer now, I don't do scripts. Check this out, we were able to get a free fruit. Someone did a spin for us. So let's answer him what? Scripting, guys. Begging is forgivable, but using scripts is not good, okay? So let's start this fruit. And before we move on to our next technique, <laughs> guys, this first one is like a joke, okay? Don't take this personally. And if you wanna beg, yeah, you can do it. Not everyone has time to play or grind fruits, okay? So next stop, guys, this is one of the easiest way. Head to the second C, okay? You don't need to be max level. There you go. And this will only be effective when you are in the public server. So guys, once in the public server, as you can see, there are lots of players. Player names, there you go. Make sure to save at the cafe, okay? And guys, just keep on changing servers and eventually, see, see that, guys? There's a fruit. Okay, if you just want fruit, use it for a... Uh, raids right awakening fruits then just head to the cafe and you will see lots and lots of fruits so here are the list of the fruits that we got from this account there you go not bad right hmm. okay so this is kind of legit on the ways how to get fruit but begging is also good head to the jungle in the first sea <laughs> almost everyone there is begging third way memorize fruit spawn locations guys just server hop guys in the public server and look for fruits not the best way to get free fruits i have a video of all the spawn locations so again guys if you have a, a fruit notifier this will really work but if you don't have again i have a video of all the location spawn locations again you can get fruits for free even though you don't have fruit notifier but again i don't suggest this strategy i'm just showing it to you see that guys there you go free fruits title unlock blessed one okay so we're gonna start this one again i don't suggest this the easiest way my second way again save in the cafe and just do server oh we already have one okay moving on guys next stop we got again the factory yes this you can only do this in the second c and this happens every one hour and 30 minutes so gamer no question is is this a sure fruit every factory no guys the highest damager will get the fruit. Again, reminder, the highest player that will damage it. Also, you can get the Acidium Rifle here. And this is a very good place to get Bounty. But I don't suggest it. Again, good place but not a good place at the same time. Everyone will get mad at you. Make sure to destroy the core of the factory uh, before 5 minutes. Okay? Within 5 minutes. So, as you can see, we're using CDK. But wait. Wait, what? Check this out, guys. Hmm. The damage of the magma is kind of low. I'm expecting like 40 to 70k damage by now. We've already used the ZX, C, and V skill. Hmm. Let's check our stats, maybe. <laughs> I think there's something wrong. Okay. <laughs> we don't have a blocks foot stats. So we're just gonna change this one. Actually, we should have used just the sword, right? CDK? Oh. Since we're here, we're just gonna change it to Buddha Fruit. There you go. And we're just gonna use Sword. <laughs> just a reminder, this one's uh, a little bit harder when you're in the public server. So I decided to do this one in the private server. Again, there might be lots of other players here, even max level players that don't want to party. And they will attack you. So again, if you have a private server, good job. If you don't have, good luck. <laughs> So you can see the damage really fast okay there you go 
Gamer Nom, I, I, I'm just going to use auto clicker here. Is it okay? Yes, guys. You won't get banned. Auto clicker is good, I think. Just don't use the scripts. Okay? Okay, so fast forward to the finish. The, I mean, finishing this one up. Also, there will be an indicator that you are the highest damager when you get a fruit. Check that out, guys. See that? We get around the fruit, dealing highest damage. And we got. Oh, we got the ice fruit. Not bad, guys. Especially when you awaken this fruit. Okay, next up, guys. Moving on. In the third C, ship raids. Actually, guys, no. You can do this in both second and third C. Okay? There you go. So, uh, ships. I mean, not ship. Both ships will attack you. I suggest using magma to burst these ships. Don't forget the stats, okay? <laughs> As you can see, I can defeat it really fast. The downside of this strategy is that there is a chance that a sea beast might spawn. Oh, we got a smoke fruit. Also fragment, okay? So again, there are pros and cons to doing this uh, strategies to get free fruits. Next up, guys, is pirate raid at the sky. Uh, sorry, sky castle, sea castle. <laughs> this is only done in the third sea. You can do this every one hour and fifteen minutes. Okay, again, factory one hour thirty minutes. Pirate raids one hour fifteen minutes, and this is how it looks like. Uh, guys, any fruit will do. But if you're gonna ask me again, two of my favorite fruits, magma fruit, I'm using it now, and the Buddha fruit. Why Buddha fruit? You can just M1. This enemies, every one of them. So guys, the final blow will get the fruit. Compared to the uh, factory, right? The highest damager. But in this raid, the one that will deal the final blow will get the fruit. So it's kind of different. So again, it really depends to you on what do you want to grind on. Is it the pirate factory or just beg? <laughs> Here you go guys, random blocks fruit dealing the final blow. Okay guys, so last one. Uh, I don't know if, this is not free actually, but just to spin fruits, right? So for example me, I have like 15, uh, more than 15 accounts to be honest. And you can just spin fruits. Gamer Nom, you need to pay, yes. But guys, when you like uh, grind a lot, for example me, I have 300 million. Guys, when I spin fruit, I think it will only cost me like, uh, like 300,000. So, you won't even notice this. <laughs> so again, this is almost equal to free, right? And this is like the sixth uh, example. So, uh, again, according to the title, only five ways. Just This is just additional. Also, don't forget, there are uh, events from the developers. They also give free fruits. So guys, just better watch out for that. And again, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. We got a portal fruit. This is Gamer Nom, and Gamer Nom out.